welcome we will start with very basic question what is the difference between drug discovery and drug development drug discovery is the identification of a potential drug target whereas drug development is the process of testing and bringing that drug to the market second question what is the drug development process the drug development process involves discovering designing testing and bringing a new drug to the market what are the key stages in drug development the key stages include discovery preclinical testing clinical trials and regulatory approval explain the concept of drug target a drug target is a specific molecule or cellular component that a drug aims to interact with to produce a therapeutic effect what are the major challenges in drug discovery challenges include target identification compound screening safety assessment and high development cost what is basic difference between preclinical trials and clinical development in pharma industry the basic difference is that preclinical trials involves testing on non human subjects example animals to assess a drug safety and efficacy while clinical development involves testing on human subjects example patients to further evaluate safety and efficacy in clinical settings what is the role of pharmacokinetics in drug development pharmacokinetic studies how the body absorbs distributes metabolizes and eliminates drug what is a phase 1 clinical trial phase 1 trials involves testing a new drug in a small group of healthy volunteers to assess safety and dosage what is the primary objective of a phase 2 clinical trial phase 2 trials evaluate a drug's effectiveness and side effects in a larger group of patients what is the purpose of a phase 3 clinical trial phase 3 trials confirm the drug's effectiveness monitor side effects and compare it to standard treatments what is a new drug application or nda an nda is a formal request submitted to the fda for approval to market a new drug in the united states what is the orphan drug designation and why is it important orphan drug designation is given to the drugs developed for rare diseases providing incentives like market exclusivity what is the role of biomarkers in drug development biomarkers are used to measure drugs responses and predict patient outcome explain the patent cliff in the pharmaceutical industry the patent cliff refers to the expiration of patents on profitable drugs leading to generic competition what is the importance of regulatory affairs in drug development regulatory affairs ensures that drugs meet safety efficacy and quality standards required for approval purposes what is the role of toxicology in drug development toxicology assesses the safety and potential harm of drugs to humans what are good manufacturing practices or gmp gmp are regulatory guidelines that ensures the quality and consistency of a drug manufacturing what is a clinical trial protocol a clinical trial protocol outlines the study's objective design and methodology what are the common challenges in recruiting and retaining patients for clinical trials challenges include patient eligibility informed consent and patient retention what are the phases of post marketing surveillance the phases are signal detection signal confirmation and signal assessment what is the role of the institutional review board that is irb in clinical trials IRB is ensure that clinical trials are conducted ethically and protect participants. Explain the concept of pharmacovigilance. Pharmacovigilance is the science and activities related to the detection, assessment, understanding and prevention of adverse effects or any other drug related problems. What is the FDA's breakthrough therapy designation? It is the designation that expedites or speed up the development and review of drugs for 
सीरियस और लाइफ थ्रेटनिंग कंडीशन वॉट आर द की फैक्टर्स इन्फ्लुएंसिंग द प्राइसिंग ऑफ ए न्यू ड्रग फैक्टर्स इंक्लूड डेवलपमेंट कॉस्ट कॉम्पिटिशन एंड मार्केट डिमांड हाउ डज द फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री एड्रेस इशूज ऑफ ड्रग अफोर्डेबिलिटी एंड एक्सेस इशूज ऑफ ड्रग अफोर्डेबिलिटी एंड एक्सेस आर एड्रेस थ्रू पेशेंट असिस्टेंस प्रोग्राम्स डिस्काउंट्स एंड कोलाबरेशन विद एन जी ओज वॉट आर बायोसिमिलर्स एंड हाउ डू दे डिफर फ्रॉम जेनरिक ड्रग्स बायोसिमिलर्स आर हाईली सिमिलर टू बायोलॉजिक ड्रग्स बट नॉट आइडेंटिकल वाइल जेनरिक ड्रग्स आर आइडेंटिकल टू देयर ब्रांड काउंटर पार्ट्स वॉट इज पर्सनलाइज मेडिसिन इन द कॉन्टेक्सट ऑफ ड्रग डेवलपमेंट पर्सनलाइज मेडिसिन टेलर्स ट्रीटमेंट टू इंडिविजुअल पेशेंट्स कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स सच एज जेनेटिक्स वॉट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ डेथ इन द ड्रग डेवलपमेंट एंड हाउ कैन इट बी एड्रेस्ड द वैल्यू ऑफ डेथ इज द फंडिंग गैप बिटवीन रिसर्च एंड क्लिनिकल ट्रायल्स एड्रेसिंग इट इन्वॉल्व इंक्रीज कोलेब्रेशन एंड इन्वेस्टमेंट फ्रॉम बोथ पब्लिक एंड प्राइवेट सेक्टर्स वॉट इज द रोल ऑफ सी डी एस सी ओ इन द ड्रग डिस्कवरी इन इंडिया द सेंट्रल ड्रग स्टैंडर्ड कंट्रोल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन दैट इज सी डी एस सी ओ इन इंडिया हैज फॉलोइंग रोल्स इन द फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री फर्स्ट रेगुलेशन सेकेंड अप्रूवल थर्ड सेफ्टी मॉनिटरिंग फोर्थ क्वालिटी कंट्रोल फिफ्थ इंटरनेशनल कोलेब्रेशन एंड सिक्स कंज्यूमर प्रोटेक्शन What are the newer techniques or approaches for new drug molecule? Following are the few newer techniques or approaches for new drug molecule, which includes AI-driven drug discovery, nanotechnology in drug delivery, 3D printing of pharmaceuticals, and targeted protein degradation. What is inverse docking and bioinformatics? Both are the drug discovery concepts. Inverse docking is a computational method used. in drug discovery inverse docking helps to identify potential drug candidate that could interact with a particular target by predicting the binding affinity and conformation whereas bioinformatics is an interdisciplinary field that applies to computational method to biological data it involves the storage analysis and interpretation of biological informations such as dna sequences protein structure and genetic data last and very important question which guidelines are commonly referred in the pharmaceutical industry for new drug discovery and development following is the list of top 10 guidelines that are used for new drug discovery and development in the pharmaceutical industry you can refer these guidelines for reference purpose Comment if you like the information subscribe to channel for more videos related to our pharmaceutical industry